Hi everyone, I'm Patrick and I'm back with the Kia today at Willow Bank. So we've had a really exciting couple of weeks since our last video as our Kia have been progressing along with their touchscreen training. In our last video, we were just giving them their first experience of the screen where we had a static image of peanut butter um, covered in real peanut butter for them to lick and just to make sure that they were happy to approach the screen. Um, and that has been a huge success. Since then, we've made a lot of progress. So firstly, we've made a more permanent sun shield for it to um, make the screen clearer. And then we've moved on to a few new tests. And just like with any training we do, we want to make sure that each new stage is incremental. The idea is that we want to keep pushing the birds without making it too challenging for them. So the first new stage we had still the same image of the peanut butter, but now instead of it just being a static image, every time they touch it, it dings and moves to a new, new location. And then we would give them a spoon of peanut butter to lick as a reward. We then made things a little more challenging by swapping that peanut butter spoon out for an image of a black token. In real life, we've trained all our birds to exchange these tokens for food. So we're interested to see if this is a skill that translates across to the screen and within their first couple of trials they were already just getting it. And that adds an extra little layer of challenge to everything because it's now a much smaller target for them to touch on the screen than um, the big peanut butter image. And instead of them getting the reward directly, we release a black token to them which they then need to exchange for food still. The final thing we've done, and I guess you could call this their first actual touchscreen test, is we introduced an orange token, a second token on the screen. Again, in real life, they're able to distinguish between the two. They know that black is rewarding, orange is not. And so they just had to replicate this on the screen and they took to this immediately, um, which is really good to see. Um, and so they'll just ignore the orange token and always go for the black on the screen. It means that they're not just touching things indiscriminately, they're actually thinking about what they're touching on the screen, which is exactly what we wanted to see at this stage. Um, and it means that we're able to move on to some more advanced tests with them. So is there anything in particular you'd like to see us try with the touch screen? Um, please leave a comment and don't forget to like, subscribe, all that jazz so you know when the next video is coming out. And I will see you all again very soon. Thank you very much and bye.